Okay, guys, so um, here's the antenna. I don't know what happened to the video. It got messed up. I don't know where it is. It just didn't record. But the plate, there's a plate here. I screwed the plate onto the wood. And then I just pressed my foil in here from underneath. Let's see if I can turn this. Just like this, okay? I just pressed it in. You can make this a lot better. You know, you can make this a lot better than... This is a rough, a rough job I did here, okay? This is a rough job. You don't have to worry about all this or nothing. You just wrap your plate aluminum foil back and front. Okay? And you might want to use two nails. Keep this wobble out of here. See this? I didn't have that before. I quickly th threw this up on the shed. It hit this. It bent the whole thing. It messed it all up. So I'm going to fix this tomorrow. So I want to do some more stuff with it. With good weather, I want to see how many channels this gets. Like when the sun's out, the sky is blue. We want to see how much sun we get here. And then when I put this plate on, Okay, you, you screw this plate on. You can use two screws to secure this. After it's secured, then you put your uh, aluminum foil on, okay? So that part of the video is missing. I just wanted to share it with you guys. Unbelievable. Uh, the sun is out. Hey guys, go ahead and get yourself another plate. You want to draw a circle. Do a rough cut here. Doesn't have to be perfect. Doesn't have to be perfect, okay? I'll show you when I'm done. Good enough. Good enough. Okay, guys, you're gonna want to tap a hole in the center. You know, go a little bit into the wood. I got a plan. Putting a plan together. This is assorted flat washers. Assorted flat washers. They're uh, plastic. Okay. And you could even go bigger on the bottom. You could go bigger on the bottom. Okay. Okay, guys. I went bigger. I took a big drill bit, made a hole. It's easy to make a hole. You could use a knife or whatever. Okay, it looks really big there. It's about a half inch. I peeled away some of the aluminum because I don't want no accident or mistakes. I want to do this and get it done the right way. Now I'm going to start loading everything onto my screw. Loading all my rings onto my screw. So that's going to go in a little bit there. Actually, we're going to go in that far. That's, that's pretty good size. That's a pretty good size to go in. Piece of wood. Okay, get my drill bit in place. Get lined up with the hole. You can even feel it. You can feel it go go into the wood, kind of into the wood. Okay, we're look good. Yes. So I went. I took the same thing. I traced out that white piece of paper down there with the one I just screwed in here. I traced. I made an indentation here. Basically, you can come here, kind of line that up, start folding this under, nice and easy, nice and easy. When it comes to this kind of stuff, guys, no rush. I'm rushing so I can do this video for you. You can make this really nice. But you're not rushing. You don't have to rush. And you can use other things. You know, instead of a paper plate. Okay. So this is going to be our receiver. This here is going to be our uh, reflector. <clears throat> our reflector in our ground. This is our hot. And down here we're going to try to bunch something up here. 
um, to connect our to connect our ground wire to freaking gypsy worms. We're just gonna bunch this up if we can. There we go. If you have to rip a little bit, rip it. Okay. There we go. Again, guys, I'm just doing this quick, okay? I'm doing this really, really quick to get this out to you. Let's get this down again. Okay. You might want to throw some hot glue on that plate and put your aluminum down. How does this get moved? You might want to throw some hot, hot glue on a plate and press your aluminum down. And you can smooth it out with a, a piece of wood, um, cardboard or something. You know, just smooth it out a little. Get it all in there, then wrap it, okay? This is a quick uh, project for me, so I'm trying to get this out to you guys. Next step is connecting our cable line. Okay, guys, find yourself some wire, some scrap wire or something. It's hard for me to see the screen out here. But let's find some scrap wire. I try to cut them the same length, and then if I have to make an adjustment because one is taller than the other, like about, I'm just going to cut this much wire. If you can see that or not. It's all scrap wire, by the way, so it's not going to hurt me any. The least brightest color is going to be the ground, okay? So this will be the ground. This will be the hot. Okay? So I'm going to figure out where I'm going to put everything onto here. And I'll be back with you. Got a plane up there trying to see what I'm building. Maybe, maybe not. It's very hazy up there, by the way. Look at that. Okay, so guys, uh, let me see if I can see. I turned up my brightness. So that's about uh, how much wire I got. About two inches. Cleaned off. Now I'm going to insert it in a hole. And in the hole, I just use this, the screw. You can do it by hand too, you know, just grab an area and just work your screw in and go all the way through. I did the same with the ground as well, guys. About two inches for the ground. Instead of wasting a bunch of ties, I got some really old tape from Harbor Freight. I bought a couple rolls of this stuff, so this is really old. What I'm going to do is just wrap this around these wires here. You know, this is good if you want if you're camping. You know, uh, use a rock to score this. If you don't have uh, a way to score this, any fire or anything like that, guys, you could just grab a freaking rock. Here's one. And put this on a rock and just go like this. That's going to scrape that, you know, do that in like two places. All I'm going to do is get my hot wire on here. Tightly wind if you can. If you can. That's good. Now. I'm just going to bend this over a little bit and squeeze this here if I can. Or just tap it down. Okay, that's not going nowhere. I'm going to get a little piece of tape. Keep the rain or whatever off of it. I don't think it'll hurt it, you know. No joke, it's really hot out here. I hope you uh, enjoy this video. I'm sweating like crazy. <laughs> I'm 
go ahead and get some tape on here and I'm going to get some tape down in here. So guys, you see that there's no wire on this antenna. It comes up underneath, all right? There's a little black knob right here. Let me see if I can zoom in on that for you. See that knob right there? That's where I connect my cable wire, okay? For this antenna. And you can see there's no no wires connected there at all okay that's because I'm using this antenna wire that's already plugged into my TV with this antenna wire okay guys so right here I have two uh, two by twos something yeah two two by twos and I got like a one by one. I could take that up higher if I needed to. But there's our little thing up there. Our little uh, antenna. Okay, let me get the uh, channel search here. I'm gonna ch Four channel. Come on, let's get five. Five? No. I have to adjust the antenna, guys. I have to put the antenna somewhere where the trees isn't blocking it, okay? Plus, we got a thunderstorm moving over. Okay, we got the news channel. The best part is all of this can be solved. Got the news channel. That's important. Tornadoes, hurricanes, whatever. Boom. Which We might have a tornado today. I don't know. Okay, we got 16-2. Absolutely beautiful. 38-1. Wasabi channel. Nice and clear. I can't go. 382 Me TV. I like that channel. You know, Western's on there. Comet Channel, 382. Stadium Channel. Catch up on some sports. 384. Catch up on some sports out in a camping uh, site there. Or you could catch up on your religion. We got the Faith Channel, which is just a blue screen. I don't understand. 43.2, day star, no signal. And CTN HD stars. channel. Another faith channel, lifestyle channel. That are watching. Another faith channel. It's a no signal channel. Thunderstorm overhead. 44.2, the kids channel. Keep the kids happy while camping. All right, watch some cartoons, you know. Right, okay, it's raining. 44.3, create channel. Not bad for your webs. D sixty four one ion channel. Like the movie channel is going on there. D sixty four two Kubo Nickelodeon. Another one for the kids, guys. D sixty four three the ion light. Mm, another one for the wife, guys. Sixty four four shopping channel. Sixty four five shopping channel QBC. We got Rolling Thunder going on, guys. Sixty four six shopping network. And then we're back to 16.1. Okay, guys, there's the antenna. This is the real deal, guys. I just showed you the channels it's getting. Nothing's made up. I have no reason to make up anything, okay? Now, if you look over here, there's a big giant tree in a way with a lot of leaves, okay? A lot of leaves. I'll take you out of zoom. I'm hearing some uh, thunder. So that's way up there. A lot of leaves in the way. So this is out in the open. Probably pick up a few more channels. I got close. I gotta. I gotta bang this up, guys. Thanks for watching. Smash the like button.